Everything She wants I see she gets Now that's my daughter in the water Everything she owns I bought her Everything she owns now That's my daughter in the water Everything she knows I taught her Everything she knows Everything I say She takes to heart Everything She takes She takes apart and That's my daughter in the water Every time she fell I caught her Every time she fell that's my daughter in the water I lost every time I fought her Yeah, I lost every time And every time She blinks, she strikes somebody blind Everything She thinks it blows a little tiny mind that's my daughter in the water Who'd have ever thought her? Who'd have ever thought? And that's my daughter in the water I lost every time I fought her Yeah, I lost every time Daughter! Loudon Wainwright III. Hello, my veteran friends and all my friends who have tuned in to learn this sweet little tribute to everybody's daughter everywhere. So it's a fairly little known song from a fairly little known artist, Loudon Wainwright III. Um, his son, Rufus Wainwright, um, is uh, quite the singer songwriter in his own right. Uh, but anyway, let's talk about the structure of this song. First, you may have noticed I've got a full capo on fret five, okay? And then we're um, playing four fairly simple chord shapes. The first is a C. Everybody knows how to play a C. That was the first chord I ever learned was the C chord. And then the second chord in the song is a G a plain old G. And then the third chord is an F major 7. So the way I'm playing it is wrapping that old thumb around to catch um, the first fret of the sixth string and then fretting uh, fifth string on fret 3, fourth string on fret 3, third string on fret 2, second string on fret 1, and then the first string, unlike an F, the first string isn't fretted, so it's got that nice, beautiful, lush, major seventh sound. Now, it's perfectly acceptable to play that with three fingers, the um, ring on string four, fret three, middle on string three, fret two, and index on string two, fret one. And you can even throw that open fifth string in, or if you want to wrap the thumb around and catch the um, bass note, that first fret of the sixth string, that's another way to do it. So, however you can most quickly and easily get to it, sounds fine in this song. Okay, and then the fourth and final chord is an A minor. Okay, five string chord fairly simple, basic, beginner-level chord. Okay, so now let's talk about the strum pattern. So what I'm doing is um, playing the bass note twice and then doing a down, down, up on the remaining, uh, the remaining notes in the chord. So it's, I'll just stay on the C note and play it a few times through for you.
of emulates as if you have a bass guitarist playing with you. And then every once in a while I'll hammer um, on that C chord, I'll hammer my middle finger on that second fret of the fourth string. Just to give it some texture. And then outside of the intro and the outro, which I just made up to be a simple way to enter in and to exit from uh, the song, the, um, the chord changes, the pattern is consistent throughout verse and, um, and chorus. So it's a C, G, F major 7th, G, A minor, F major 7th, C, G. Repeat again, C, G, F major 7th, G, A minor, F major 7th, C, G. So that's really the pattern for the whole song. In the original, there's a kind of a whacked out bridge, uh, instrumental bridge in it that goes to a whole bunch of different chord changes. I just left that part out because I think, you know, this simple little song does it stands alone just fine without a bridge in it so okay i think i've told you everything you need to know uh, to play this song so let's close out with the intro and then the first verse and the first chorus everything she sees she says she wants I see she gets Now that's my daughter in the water Everything she owns I bought her Everything she owns and That's my daughter in the water Everything she knows I taught her Everything she knows So there you have it, daughter beautiful little song. I know when I first heard it, it kind of choked me up a little bit. I have three children and they're all daughters. And uh, there's a lot of truth in the lyrics in this song. So any of you that have daughters, I hope uh, this song, uh, the lyrics uh, inspire you to learn how to sing and play. So have a fantastic week. Enjoy singing and playing this song, and I look forward to sending you another song very soon. Until then, adios, my friends.